thanks to the doctors and the emergency team around here. Um, uh, Dr. Yusuf and Dr. Manzur, uh, I would really th thank them specifically uh, uh, while, while you know incubating her at the right time and uh, getting her out of this problem. Yes. So uh, we are very happy now, uh, ladies, that uh, now when she is going to get discharge. Right. I just want to know what is the uh, situation when yeah. you uh, decided to go for this ICD. ICD is a, yes. that is a small implant that takes yes. right, right. weekly for the patient yeah. to prevent certain cardiac death. True. When did you yeah. decide to put this? Yeah, so uh, see, uh, she is a heart patient and uh, she had to, uh, she had undergone a mitral valve replacement ah. and uh, she was recovering with that and subsequently uh, she had a sudden cardiac uh, problem which is like a very, very severe and critical situation and uh, uh, this is like, uh, I mean, it all happened in front of me, frankly speaking. So, when was, was, uh, when was this it? was like a few months back. A few months back. Few months back. Where was uh, it? This was in Bangalore. Bangalore. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you have seen yeah. that your yeah. mother is almost dying. It, it, all, it almost happened in front of me, just right in front of me. I was uh, I was just watching her. I just had given the food to her and I was, she was just taking a small nap. And uh, there was a sudden, it was uh, almost a sudden, uh, what, what do you call it, sudden death situation. Sudden right? death, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We call so, it as an SCV. Yeah, Sudden yeah. cardiac yes, death. Right, Unexpected right. death in yeah, front yeah. of you. Yeah, so basically it was uh, my alertness actually. So I went there and then she was just rushed on the ventilator and go into the ICU. And, uh, and the only solution that we actually had for that was, uh, you know, uh, what we call that as an ICD, uh, which, which actually gives, uh, in, in certain cases, in the case what my mother had, she had uh, uh, what we call as a ventricular fibrillation. It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's like a VTNP in short we call. So uh, she developed that and for, for this situation uh, one of the best solutions uh, is yeah, you know, the, one of the best solutions what was advised uh, for us was you know we go ahead with the ICD uh, implantation to the patient. Situation. Same, uh, what exactly happened is we call it as AICD, Automatic right. Implantable Cardiomotive Implant. Yes. And the doctor advised you from Bangalore to immediately implant that. True. And you have taken that, okay, you have seen in front of uh, your eyes that your mother is dying. Yes. So they saved the, that moment, yeah. but every time you will not be in the hospital. Right. So you have to put an implantation so that yes. whenever this problem happens on the right. road, yes. at the home or wherever yes. it is, yeah. and that machine will take care of the heart. Yes, that's that true. is what is a basically that with AICD. True, sir. Yes. So when you, uh, last six months you didn't have much problem, yes. and about one week back, in Futu, you yes. had a problem again, your mother had a problem again. Yes. Then you know, what exactly happened and why did you uh, come to India so fast because she was almost yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so like the current situation that we had. So she had a week back, she actually, uh, she was uh, she was going unconscious uh, and suddenly she was getting revived. So this reviving was nothing but the, uh, the, it's the ICD which was giving the reverse shocks so that she comes out of that collapsing situation. So, uh, so okay, uh, we uh, we saw that one episode, and then subsequently this was happening uh, one after the other in that way. So that was like, uh, and and that was like very scary and. Uh, so, what, what exactly happened, you know, uh, yeah. for your mother that day? Yeah. See, all this time uh, it was not uh, she was not having that VTB. VTB means heart is going to beat yes. at a rate of four hundred. Normally, heart beat is about seventy. Right. But right. when it beats at a rate of four hundred. Yeah. Within five, within few minutes, the patient will die. True, sir. Okay, yes. so immediately you have to bring the heart back to seventy heart. Rate. Right. Then yes. the machine was doing that right thing. Yes. Machine yes. was doing because you put an implant. Yes. And the, that machine was recognizing the form of heart rate. Right. Immediately give. Yeah. But unfortunately, what will happen? It, it should not be keep on getting again and again. Yes. When you do keep on getting again and again, the machine cannot. Keep on sure. delivering or 10 times, 20 times it can deliver. Yes. After that, it cannot further deliver yes. because the machine will yes. battle with fake. Right. So, you recognize that immediately you came to Diana Hospital. Yes. Then we recognize what was going wrong. She was having right. multiple problems. Why yes. she had yes. this type of VT and VF? Right. She had multiple problems. What yes. is this program or was uh, we have to reprogram it? Mm -hmm. The machine, you have to reprogram it. Mm -hmm. And then she had potassium low. Yes. And she had uh, some breath interactions. Right. And many hospitals and many doctors will not be. Uh, able to properly uh, uh, properly yes. adjust the medications sure. and they don't know uh, these type of uh, very few centers are using this right. and mangrove only one or two centers we are using routinely right. this type of thing so right. other doctors may not be able to uh, right. understand the problem that maybe the other another reason she suddenly become very bad sure. so fortunately at the right. right time Mother Kumansu attended yes. 
and they incubate it and then they started medications, next Very day good. we reprogrammed it yes. and after that she never had any BDPF. No. And uh, I think it is a rebirth for... Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, so it is, I mean, we can't just imagine that situation again coming. <laughs> <laughs>